Hi guys, it's Maggie from Magnificent Tarot and I am back. Um, I'm still working on the love readings for each element. I am editing videos, but I'm gonna be doing dailies per sign and I'm gonna go ahead and start with the sign of Aries. And this is a daily reading. Today is the 5th, yeah. Today is June 5th. And this is for the sign of Aries. It's going to take three cards. This is a general reading for the sign of Aries. Love, career, family matters. June 5th for the sign of Aries. Let me charge these cards up. Let me see what I got at the bottom here. Four of Wands here. Three of Swords, Four of Wands. I don't know if the cameras, let me just make sure I get everything. Now lately I've been having trouble. Charge up these cards here, Justice. Oops, let's try it again. One more time. Queen of Pentacles, Justice. I like to look at those cards. All right. Can you please give me a message today for our sign of Aries, June 5th, 2018, general reading. Mm, okay, nothing wants to fall out. We don't have to split the deck. No more trouble. One, two, what the? Let me see if everything's in reverse. No. All right, Aries. <laughs> Page of Pentacles in reverse, the Hermit in reverse, and the Nine of Cups in reverse. Okay, so in your past position, you got a message and it's in reverse. So maybe you didn't get the news you received wasn't so good for you guys. Hmm. Herman in reverse tells me there was a time of retrospection. Here. Didn't get any good news here. Usually the her hermit, you know, I'm not going to read it in the reverse, you know. I mean, in reverse, I could say you were fearful of something here. Maybe something related to a relationship. Um, found out something about the person you were dealing with here. Um, intu intuitively, I'm, think I'm feeling like you found out or if someone, you know, someone gave you a message and about the validity of the relationship, and you figured out that that person wasn't on the same page of um, page as you here. Or you're being overly cautious in a relationship or maybe you're scared to start a new relationship with someone here because of the past because of the what happened in the past because you got some bad news maybe someone broke up with you um through a text message you know email and 
Now there's a lot of fear. You're being overly cautious here. Then there's the 10, I'm sorry, the nine of cups in reverse. You didn't get your wish fulfillment, Aries. Maybe you applied for a job. Or maybe, because this is a young person. Um, maybe you applied for a job and didn't get the job. Here, when it comes to career, you apply for a job and you didn't get it. Or maybe you didn't get a promotion that you thought you were going to get. Maybe you applied, uh, you, maybe you applied for a mortgage, didn't, didn't get approved. So some type of bad news puts you in a state of fear. Here. You didn't get your wish fulfillment. Let me clarify. Let me clarify the hermit here. Clarify the hermit in reverse, please. King of Cups. Yes, so. Maybe here, because it's in the reverse position, you were dealing with someone that was untrustworthy, if, you know, as it pertains to love. Because this is a general reading um, for Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Mercury, North Node. You were dealing with someone that was dishonest. Maybe um, un you couldn't trust that person. Maybe that person was possessive. You know, and now you're overly cautious dealing with your wish for now. You know, maybe someone came in or maybe there's a new relationship on the horizon. Maybe you're talking to someone new and you can't trust. You're having trust issues because of that. You know. Maybe you're being selfish or you were dealing with someone selfish here. Someone overbearing. You know, maybe there was some scandal. You didn't get your wish fulfillment. Let me clarify the nine of cups in reverse. Page of cups. Yeah. <laughs> Again. That's a message. That message is in reverse. So you got a message that brought you bad news. So I want to say maybe the news was a breakup. You lost your job, maybe. Got fired. Didn't get a promotion. Didn't pass a test. I mean, it could be anything because this is a general reading. There was deception here. Didn't get your wish fulfillment because this could represent deception. We already know that this person is a dishonest person here, untrustworthy here. Someone told you about this person. Maybe you found out that this person was lying about something. Aries. Also with this Page of Cups card, um, calls you to use your, you know, to, for me, I, when I see it, I always tell people, you know, use your intuition in the situation you're dealing with. Excuse me. Use your intuition. Because it seems like you have some pretty sneaky people around you. Or you could have been that person giving bad news to somebody else. You know, maybe there was an attachment to something. And, and a, uh, an attachment to a person. And that person tells you that they don't want to deal with you anymore. So my advice would be 
So use your, use your intuition. Let me just grab one more card here from my tarot deck, my tarot of Arisha's deck here for the uh, advice here. Ooh, that one just fell on the floor here. Let's flip it over. See? Ten of Cups in reverse. You didn't get the fulfillment that you wanted. You didn't get the fulfillment that you wanted. And Ten of Cups usually represent family, I mean emotions, emotional fulfillment, and that particular relationship. But sometimes when things happen where it maybe it wasn't meant to be, maybe it is a time, it's time for you to move forward and find somebody, you know, go into reflection, go into a meditative state because the page of cups does talk about, uh, I believe the page of pinnacle talks about meditation. Go into a meditative state, reflect, take time to reflect, take time to meditate, take some time to yourself. Here. To heal from this situation. All right, Aries, that is your reading. Thank you. Please like, subscribe, and comment to my channel.